Howdy folks, Feedy here, back with the next episode of Crusader Kings 2 Orthodox Russia. Obviously, not a whole lot going on right now, again. But I do have... France as an ally. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and unpause it. Figure out what is going on. He's returning a favor to Duke Tatva. A learned Jewish man has appeared at your court. He comes highly recommended in the arts of bookkeeping and administration. Already he has suggested several ways of improving the bureaucratic efficiency of the realm. He could potentially make a fine steward indeed. This guy's stewardship is 10. And this guy's is 20. This guy is Catholic though, and he's one of my powerful vassals. 14. 17. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> my lord, there's a noble warrior at the gate. He says he is a veteran of many battles and desires to become a champion of your house. He praises your wisdom and honor and pledges to always defend you and your household if you will accept him in your retinue. Sure. Alright, we're going to go ahead and look at the factions. Chief Panay. No. Can't kill him. Could imprison him. But the council won't approve of that either. Known plots. Fabricate claim on his. I hold the Duchy of Mezzan, don't I? I don't. My brother does. Saddle my horse. He would give up the Duchy. My advisor died. We are going hunting for the great white bear. Yeah. 
Yeah, he still doesn't like me. Fruitlessly scouring the countryside, you come upon a small cottage in the wilds. As you knock, an old crone appears. When she sees you and your hunting party, she cackles eerily and says that she has a powerful bow potion that will make you a stronger hunter, sure to catch any prey. Uh, this might have unforeseen effects. Let's try it. You drink the potion down, soon you start to feel all warm inside the crone whispers. See, you know that this will make you stronger. I can see it in your eyes. Now go, great hunter. You return home certain in your belief that next time you will find your prey. This feels good. You have returned to your court. The hunt for this elusive white beast seems fruitless. But there are many more things out there in the wilds. Maybe next time you'll catch your prey. I won't give up. Fires 9.35, so soon we'll be getting more tax revenue. Controls that county. This guy controls them counties. Train troops in the capital. You're collecting taxes. There's got to be somebody with better learning. We're going to use the intrigue. Got somebody still trying to kill my brother. Bunch of people backing the plot. To kill me. No, really. Well, that really reduces that plot power. Six hundred and thirty four. Sure.
Who's Bo? So this actually <laughs> According to Chancellor Tatva, the peasants of Soma have started a delightful tradition where the peasantry from several villages meet up and dance, feast and pair up for future marriage. By promoting this tradition, Tatva believes that the county will develop a strong local culture that will attract more peasants. Sure, it's only going to cost two gold. We are enforcing realm peace, so that should end this war. Unfortunately, this war is not going to end. And this guy has a whole lot of troops. I'm known as the Terrible. Nice. Independence, independence. I'm gonna invite a holy man to court. And then he's gonna become our court chaplain. And then as far as my brother He's already a eunuch. Yeah, we're gonna order him to take his vows. See ya. Oh, and of course, that's who my current heir is. You are a tyrant and a rough scatterbrain. We will no longer stand by idly as you ignore the council and the well-being of your subjects. The time has come for you to abdicate in favor of Tatva Kakoid. Yeah. No. 
Ahnung. You just got here. I don't think you have a say in what goes on in my kingdom. Sorry, bro. The French are going to come help. We're just going to give out these minor titles. Court Tutor. I don't have a siege expert. Oh, that's unfortunate. Defender, inspiring leader. There we go, we have some commanders. If he comes this way, we're in trouble. But if we can finish this siege. Your marshal has come to with come to you with a suggestion, my lord. It is my opinion that Prince Num would make an excellent military military commander. I suggest we make use of his talents for the good of the realm. 
I have other candidates in mind. Whoa. His dad died. Haha, <laughs> and with his dad dying, he lost all the event spawned soldiers. Yeah. Alright. And just like that, the war is over. Goodbye. Now that you were in prison, I don't care if it makes me a tyrant, I am taking your title. And you can die in my prison. So I now... my other brother oh he is my only brother all right and on that note we are going to wrap this up here and as always if you enjoyed the content please remember to like comment and subscribe and we will catch you in the next one